Hello viewers, I'm here again, Ma'am Michelle. At this moment, I will give you another tutorial on how to remove this message error here. No available camera input. So it means device is unable or device is unable or used by another application. So this will happen when you use this snap app in messenger you use it in uh, let's say zoom you use it in google meet so the, the device or the settings of this snap is still there the settings is not yet ready to to completely connect or or the, the, the settings of snap is not yet ready to completely synchronize in the new platform platform that you are going to use let's say you use your teams so today I'm going to give you a tutorial on how to remove this message here no available camera input when you use your teams this tutorial will also work on uh, zoom or if you're using zoom if you use your google meet if you use your messenger call if you use a snap camera in uh, in the steams so here i've already prepared this uh, teams window here so that there will be no lag that we're going to experience so I've already checked the settings here the device settings this is under teams so everything is all right uh, I will not touch anything here because th this works with this supposedly th this is the the exact settings that should be seen in this box here in this teams window so i will not touch anything as i've mentioned we are going to remove this no available camera input uh, since everything is already set up if everything is already set up this step will work for you but make it sure that your camera here is already in snap you wonder why even if you've already set up everything but still you can see this uh, logo of snap camera supposedly you will be able to see your face here so that's because once again the message here no available camera input the device is enabled or used by another application though you did not use any other application so here we're now going to check the settings of snap in my end these are just the information that should be set up here so I didn't touch anything because this information works when I use the snap so I will not touch anything any information in snap here so I am just leading you in these settings just to make sure that show snap code overlay is turned off because if you will turn it on when you use snap on your teams the other person whom you talk to will be able to see the logo um, of snap they will be able to see this this logo on their end so just make sure that you turn it off in this settings so we'll go back no available camera input so here all we need to do is to go to this if you can see this small arrow here the small arrow up it says here show 
hidden icons if you hover your mouse so it's a show hidden icon so we're going to show the the hidden icons here so there are icons that you can see here different icons so i have this uh different icons here i will not say this one by one so all i need here is the snap camera icon so do not double click this one because if you will double click this it will still give you a prompt uh the same window as what you can see here no available no available no available camera input so do not double click this instead you are going to right click it once you right click this you can see many options again so snap camera effect is off of course it's off because it says there no available camera input quick lens activation lake lake here is the one i i i search so i will be my background will be in the lake and then another thing that i searched before is mountain mountains so i wanted to be in the uh, mountains when i have my call with my students then open snap camera settings in quit so we're not going to to select this lake here because if you're going to select still the message is there also the mountain we're going, not going to select mountain open snap camera it's already open settings we can we've already checked the settings a while ago so all we need to do is to select this quit option here so i am going to select quit and there it's gone so in i'll open once again the snap camera so it takes uh see i'm here you can see me now hello everyone hello. don't forget to like subscribe and share this by the way let's make it sure that it's totally working so i want to be in a different um, location so let me type here galaxy so let me see if snap will give me a galaxy background so i'm going to see here how about this one let me try it Ooh. so here i'm in this kind of background now so it's so it's so fun if you have a different background with your students because sometimes background can give us mot motivation or excitement in uh, making our meeting with with someone or with the students or with a group memorable so even though we cannot go out still just in our background we will be able to transfer or to go to a different location so let me see if i want to have or i want to be um, a fish yeah i became a fish before when i had my tutorial in i think it was messenger so let me try this fish here oh it's here okay so we're going to wait for a few minutes to load this fish here hello fish oh see it's here hi okay or you wanted to you wanted to be in the clouds so let me try or in the sky let me try if i can be in the sky um, 
I don't like that. I think I want to be in a in the clouds. So clouds here. I'm checking here if I can be in the cloud. Let me see. Oh hi. I'm here in the clouds meeting with you or talking to you now. <laughs> That's a joke. Okay, and I am here in my team's window. So as what you can see, at the moment, this is now my face. A while ago, you were able to see the logo of the snap. So it was not working. But at this time, when the message no available camera input, is removed so it's now my face so it's finally working it's successfully working so once again all you need to do is just to click this one here this arrow small arrow here then do not double click th this one snap camera icon instead just right click it then select quit then open once again the the snap camera and it should be totally working thank you for watching please don't forget to subscribe and share this link so we can help others thank you bye